my knowledge, no Korean sunscreens have ever actually been approved for sale on the Australian market. Uh, and that usually throws up a whole heap of questions for Aussies in particular, uh, you know, and people wanting to know, well, Lauren, like, what do you use then? Do you use Korean sunscreens in Australia? What do you recommend? Long story really short, because this is not really the point of today's episode. In a nutshell, no, I do not use Korean or Japanese sunscreens whenever I'm in Australia. Uh, and the reason is that they just haven't been subjected to our local testing regimes there, which does not give me the confidence I need as a very, very fair skinned person that is really prone to things like freckles, melasma, pigmentation, all of those kind of things. I do not have the confidence I need to wear Korean sunscreens when I am in Australia, uh, sweating out in the heat. Uh, we have a very particular climate in Australia that is not the same as the climate in Korea.